Good afternoon, ladies and gents, viewers and subscribers. This is your host, Elgin Martinez from the Immigrant Education Channel, the only channel that addresses real immigrant issues. Coming to you with another informative video. But ladies and gents, the video today is going to be about your USCIS document receipt number. Ladies and gents, if you are applying for any type of immigration benefits in the U.S., every document that is sent to you by USCIS is going to have what is known as a receipt number. That receipt number can be found in the top left corner of that document, ladies and gents. And the purpose of that receipt number is to enable you, the applicant, that is the immigrant applicant, to be able to pull up your immigration case status online by simply going to the USCIS.gov website and checking for the case status online. That being said, ladies and gents, as I said, that receipt number is going to consist of 13 characters, right? So it's going to be three letters and the 10 numbers. So your receipt number would start with, say, for example, L-I-N, right? That's the letters followed by 10 numbers or E-A-C or M-S-C or N-B-C, etc. That being said, ladies and gents, we've come to the end of this video. Please share, like, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you can be informed whenever I upload another video. Last but not least, Thanks to all of my viewers and subscribers, and thanks for your continued support. And if you are new to the channel, ladies and gents, please do not hesitate to subscribe. So yes, ladies and gents, the video today, as I say again, was about your USCIS receipt number, right? That's a number that's going to be on every correspondent that USCIS has with an applicant or anyone that's applying for some form of immigration benefit. Every document that you receive from USCIS is going to have a receipt number in the top left corner, ladies and gents, which is used to check your case status or that is your immigration case status online. All right, so what I'm saying is that you don't even need to go to an attorney to check your case status online. All you got to do is go to your receipt number, as I said, which is in the top left corner of your USCIS document, whatever document it may be. It may be an N336, an N400, or I-130. You know, the receipt number is going to be in the same area, which is the top left corner. It's going to consist of three letters and uh, ten numbers. That being said, ladies and gents, we co we've come to the end of this video. Once again, please share, like, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you can be informed whenever I upload another video. Last but not least, thanks to all of my viewers and subscribers, and thanks for your continued support.